Alright, hey guys, it's Real Seth here, and today I'm going to be making a guide for uh, getting good crafting XP. You're going to need 62 crafting to start this off, but uh, after that, you make a lot more profit than you were at 62. This, Yeah, you do make profit from this, so it's really good. What you're going to need uh, to help a lot would be a war tortoise so you can put more clay into him. You're, gonna, you're just going to fill it up like that. You can have your thing set to call follower or take beast of burden. I have it as follower, so I can just close my bank with it and then run. Well, I mean, close my bank with it and then just uh, store stuff in the, the, the tortoise. So the what you want to start out with is uh, Infernal Urns if you're 62. And at 76, you can go to uh, Decorated Fishing Urns. And uh, I only have 78, so I have to do Fishing Urns. Uh, but after that, at 81 crafting, you can do Decorated Cooking Urns. And uh, once I start cooking, or once I start making this, uh, go ahead and just do that and uh, I'll go ahead and start talking about the other stuff uh, at 62 it's 52 K XP per hour when you're making the infernal prayer urns and at 76 you make 57 K XP per hour and at 81 it's 61 K XP per hour uh, take beast of burden here so you can uh, go ahead and start the process of making more and you can take beast of burden again but you don't really have to because it's only just two clay and you'll have to click so you'll you'll lose you'll waste a few seconds just making one more urn and after you make them you go over here and you use them on this this is where it becomes sort of afk because it takes a good bit for these to get uh turned into uh, co uh, the cooked version of those so it's pretty much afk you can maybe do homework while you're doing this i remember i was playing uh, this pool game on the computer and uh, I, I got a lot of it done before I finished my inventory but it's still really really good XP per hour as you see uh, this right here is just from two two runs back and forth from the bank I'm in the Varrock I'm in Varrock over by the purescent bots so you can just follow them if you wanna get here quickly or if you wanna just AFK more you can just follow them and then click into here but uh, I don't know if I told you the profit and loss yet. But uh, at making inferno urns, you make you lose 200 GP, and then from the decorated fishing urns, you make over 200 GP, just a little bit over. And for the cooking urns, you make just 50 GP. So from fishing urns, you make the most, and you only lose about like 4k XP per hour. But if you don't use a war tortoise, you also lose about 5k. So you'll lose 10k for making fishing urns without a tortoise but if you do cooking urns without a tortoise it's about the same speed as making fishing urns with a tortoise so whichever one you want to get getting a war tortoise would be good because you can make a lot of a lot more per inventory and uh, it's basically doing two inventories in one run so yeah that's pretty much it I think I explained everything that I wanted to explain it's not too many clicks from the bank to the place of which you're making these and you can just one click back by clicking to the zip right there and from there and uh, yeah uh, I don't want to miss anything so I'm pretty sure I got it you can do this in resizable I think it helps clicking a little bit more and uh, oh another way you want to have this position so you don't have to keep going left and right is have it so you can just barely tell like you can just barely see that fishing right there and you click it and then you'll be right here decorated so you won't have to really just mess around too much you can just click that click that and then click over here and you'll start making them but uh yeah that's it for this guide it was a pretty short guide because it's a pretty simple thing but it i used to do it a lot i got a few levels in a couple days from it and uh thanks for watching comment rate and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video